Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Oh, if you're new to our little channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. Um, so I just did Libra. I have no idea who's going to be next. Because I'm not making decisions still. I'm letting cards do it. So, who's next? Just trying to get all these knocked out. Hopefully by Friday. Oh, Taurus, good. Oh, <laughs> going to be a challenge. Finally an Earth sign. Just kidding. Um, <laughs> I'm done with fire signs until the end of the cycle because Leo's got to go last this time. Anyway. Where was I going with that? Anywho, yeah. Trying to get them all done. Hopefully by Friday. If I don't get them done by Friday, it might extend into my vacation a little bit, and that's okay. Um, ultimately, I just want to get them done by the first so you guys can all get your readings on time for a change. But enough of my babbling. This reading will be for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the month of September. If I can get these darn things to shuffle. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to you by the cards if you choose to do anything at all. It is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. Try to straighten these out a little bit. Just keep in mind, if it does not resonate, it might not be your reading, and that's okay too. Check your placement sign, your moon, your rising, your Venus. If you think you might want something that might resonate a little bit better, depending on where the stars were aligned, where you were born, and all that happy jazz. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. I just bold those up again. Cross watchers are always welcome here too. I know I'm only shuffling half of the deck, but I'm really trying to get these things to straighten out. Oh, without further ado, one more shuffle. These cards just need to be replaced, I think. I think they've had a heck of a ride, and I don't see myself going back to that storage unit to get those Encyclopedia Britannicas anytime soon. Because that's like an hour and ten minute drive for me, and I just don't want to do it. But, okay... All right, why you're here, what's going on with you, what's going on with the person you're dealing with, get that out of the way for a second, the obstacle and the possible resolution, why are you here, Taurus, six of swords in the reverse, oh my, could be a return, either on your part or someone else's. Hmm, okay. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Prince of Cups. They always seem to come in with a cup full of love, but I don't think they stay very long sometimes. We'll throw a clarifier on that in a minute. What do you think of them? Wheel of Fortune. Hmm... This may be something you already closed out. Or they already closed out. Well, obviously, if you get a return coming in, that's like an odd uh, thing. The tens talk about closings of cycles and beginnings of new ones. Could be a karmic thing. What do you want from them? Four of Cups. Okay. There's another cup. Could be a water sign you're dealing with, could be air, could be any of the fixed signs. So, another Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, or Aquarius. Okay. I think you just want them to acknowledge what they tried to do for you, the cup that they tried to, that you tried to give them. How do they feel about you? King of Cups in the reverse. They feel like you're emotionally closed off. Like, you have nothing to give. And weren't open to receiving. Oh, well... Huh. 
Or they could be emotionally closed off toward you, hence the ignoring of the cup thing. All right. What do they think of you? The Queen of Cups reversed well. <sighs> not given, not taken. Wow, what do they want from you? Queen of Pentacles reversed. First impression off of that, maybe they just wanted to feel needed. Okay, what's the obstacle? Ten of Wands in the reverse. Somebody not closing out a cycle. Someone very, very burdened. Someone needing to get something off of their chest. There's a burden here that was never released. I don't know if it's on your part or theirs, Taurus. But that's an obstacle. You know, excess ba baggage from past connections. Yeah, that, that's not something you want to carry with you into a new connection. Possible resolution, Prince of Pentacles. Yeah, if that's an apology. Could be an apology. Could be an olive branch, you know, the same thing, whatever. No, 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 no. <sighs> Could be taking your time. Okay, well... Huh. Universe, Source, and Spirit, can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for Taurus, please, for September Why is the Prince of Cups here? The chariot. Water sign could be a cancer you're dealing with. One more on that. That's sketchy. Because that can mean like being pulled in two different directions all the time. They're there and they're not there. I'm just seeing this image of someone constantly checking their phone. I'm seeing a face in a phone. I don't know why. One more on that. They're distant. Judge, uh, justice in the reverse. Lack of balance, things not being fair. Okay, why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Also could be a Libra that you're dealing with. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? You want to talk, I'm going to take you. Eight of Pentacles. Always at work. Always at work. Could be the reason why they're distant and always have their face in their phone. If that's, you know, setting off alarms in your brain. Page of Pentacles. 
Page of Pentacles is in the reverse. One more. Three of Swords reverse. No apologies. I think this possibly closed out. Either you closed it out or they did. They were very unapologetic about it. Or you were the unapologetic one because you just stopped putting up with it. Somebody wasn't that heartbroken about it, though. Why is the Four of Cups here? Two of Wands. Okay. One more. Six of Cups reversed in the Hermit. Mm. <sighs> Taurus. There may be a possibility that you closed this out. You want acknowledgement. You want to be able to let go and move forward. And, but you want acknowledgement. You want them to go inside and recognize what you tried to do for them. And without the salty, harsh feelings. The hermit in the upright, six of cups in the reverse. But there's sour feelings here. You just want to be acknowledged. You want to be able to let go and move forward and you can't. Okay. That might be why they think you're emotionally closed off because you just got tired of it. All right. Why is the King of Cups reversed here for how the other person feels about Taurus? Queen of Pentacles. Emotionally closed off. Independent. Had what they needed. I feel like you were a great catch. One more. Okay, I'll take two. Page of Wands in the reverse, Five of Pentacles. Yeah, you, you kicked him to the curb. They feel like you didn't need him. Wow, why is the Queen of Cups reversed here? Definitely want to talk. Emperor. They want to talk. I'm going to take them. We have a fortune reverse, shadow side reversed. It was your way or the highway. Emotionally closed off, no love to give. No closure. Why is the shadow side reversed here? The moon in the upright in the tower that but 
There was no explanation. It just all kind of fell apart. And it was quick. It was sudden. It was like right now. You kicked them off like a pair of cement shoes. They felt like they weren't good enough for you. Oh, wow. Why is the Queen of Pentacles reversed here? For what the other person wants from Taurus? The world in the reverse, the Six of Wands on top of the Queen of Pentacles. They don't want this to end. They didn't want this to end. They want to return. They, they want to feel needed. Wow, Taurus. Wow. I'm a little taken back here, if you can't tell. Why is the Ten of Wands reversed here for the obstacle in this connection? of cups reversed. Lack of acknowledgement of a connection. One more. Okay, I'll take two. Ace of Wands reversed, King of Swords reversed, Nine of Pentacles reversed. Somebody got a little bit needy? Somebody got a little bit attitudinal. Somebody wasn't lighting the other person's fire. And I think it may be having to do with somebody's old baggage. Somebody may have gotten caught in a rerun got a little spooked and bolted. Why is the Prince of Pentacles here for the possible resolution to this? man, seven of swords reversed, queen of cups reversed. Why is the queen of cups reversed here? Seven of pentacles reversed comes out. acceptance of what happened and the truth as to why. One more. taking 20 cards. I'm just not taking 20. There, there was only like four, but I'm not taking all four of them. Give me one. Thank you. 
the Empress. Growth. New beginning. A slow new beginning. Do over? Well, there is a return in the midst. Okay, well, that's super weird, but okay. Let's get some advice for you guys. All right. Three of Wands reversed in the chariot in the upright. I gotta read that with another pair because that's not making sense. Ten of Swords reversed in the double. Saying keep your distance. Don't wait for this to come back around. Keep your distance from it. And the longer you drag this out, the longer... <sighs> Ten of Swords reversed in the Devil. The longer you allow this to keep messing up your energy and... The longer you allow the sun to not shine and the longer you drag this out, the worse it's going to be. You may not have been meant to know why, Taurus. Or they may not have been meant to know why. Huh. Okay. One more on that. I don't know. Nine of Pentacles reversed in death. was a lesson here. This was meant to evolve you spiritually. I think this was meant to evolve you both spiritually. This may have been a lesson in codependence. You can't rely on somebody else for your happiness. That's not healthy. You have to find happiness within yourself. King of Wands reversed and the Four of Wands in the upright. This doesn't have to be a confrontational thing. Don't lose your passion because of this event. Either one of you don't because this was meant to open doors to other things. Knight of Pentacles and the Fool. There's better things coming for you. There's better things, new adventures, and new paths. So reconcile it if you want to or try to. But I think new beginnings are in order. I mean, if you want to have the conversation as to why, okay. If that's going to help you sleep better at night, okay. If the return comes long enough to even get your closure, that's okay. But there's new things coming for you. And I think the longer y'all drag this out and don't allow each other that closure, the worse this is going to be for both of you. That's what I'm seeing here. I I'm a Sagittarius. I'm not one for closure. But, you know, it's necessary. It's necessary. All right, guys. This is what I have for you. Super weird. Happy September, right? <laughs> Well, let me know what happens. I love you guys. Thanks for coming by. Be blessed. Crazy collective, I
out here, but I love you guys. Mm. Straighten that all. Sort when I'm done. Catching the next reading. Later, babe.